Hi, my name is Kai and I'm professor at Stuttgart Media University in Germany. And today I would like to introduce our idea of bridging the gap between Scratch and Python. Let me show you what I mean. We use Scratch for quite some time now in our introductory course to programming for our students. Our audience uh, is information scientists and future library staff. So we have a lot of people who are not only interested in learning how to program, but also interested in how to teach programming. So Scratch is a natural fit and we love it. Our students love it and we always have a great time with it. The problem is after some time, usually four to five weeks, we have to switch to Python. The problem is Python is great, but Python is not as fun as scratches and our students use, lose quite some of the motivation that they have when they use Scratch. So our idea was to actually bridge this gap and create a Python environment where people can have just as much fun as they had with Scratch. So we re-implemented Scratch in Python and provided a way that you can write code exactly in the same way how you use blocks in Scratch. And I show you how this works. And yes, of course, you can import your Scratch projects to Python and can generate the Python code to give you a head start and a smooth uh, transfer from Scratch to Python. The following uh, demonstration shows a little bit where we are right now. But be aware, you are among the very first persons in the world who actually hear about PyStage. We started just some months ago with very early prototypes. We are happy where we are right now, but this is pre-alpha. Things can break. So if you try it on your own, please get in contact with us if things do not run as you expect them to run. I'm pretty sure we can do something about it. Have fun. This is a small demonstration project that shows that we can actually move the sprites similar to a scratch. Now let's take a small project and create it in scratch and we will export it to PyStage. When you import a project using the command line, you can use a language of your choice. So here you see it in English. Now we generate the code in German and here is the Japanese version. And finally, we want to see it in action. On the right side, you see a Python code editor with a PyStage code, very easy to understand, exactly like the blocks in Scratch. And when we run the project, you see the exact same result as we had it in Scratch. So thank you very much for your attention. I hope you like PyStage and find it as exciting as we find it to be. Currently we develop it and plan to get it ready for an alpha or kind of better release later this year. And we hopefully will use it in a teaching scenario for the first time during the summer term 2022. If you're interested in the development, just get in touch and we would like to get any kind of feedback about this project. Thank you and goodbye.